Hello, everybody, and welcome to TeacherCast. My name is Jeff Bradbury. Thank you so much for joining us. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the brand new Google Sites application. We're going to be talking about how to create a Google Site and use it as a student portfolio. Here's a basic page that you're going to start off with here. And what we're going to do is we're going to come up here and change our heading. And we're going to call this My Homework Assignments. And you can see here that after I've done that, it breaks this into two lines. I'm not really interested in two lines, so I'm going to take these two blue circles and stretch this out. This should hopefully put it into one line. Then I'm over here going to come down here, and I'm going to put in my name and my class period. And that's very, very small. So we're going to come over here, highlight this, come over here, and let's make that into heading. So we have the title of our page and a little bit about us and where we are. So looking at a portfolio, a por portfolio is really just a place to stick your homework and maybe make some reflections. So let's do that. Let's say, for instance, I have a Google slide here that I've been working on for homework assignments. And I'm going to come over here and click on insert. And here we have our Thanksgiving turkey as our homework assignment. This is a Google Slides project we've been working on. So now I want to insert some reflection. I want to put a reflection piece over here. So I'm going to hit the text box, drop this down. I'm going to take this little tab. I'm going to bring this up. And here is a great spot for students to write a reflection. So I just typed in, in this homework assignment, I learned. So here's a great way to use Google Sites as a personal reflection. Another thing that we can do is add a heading to this assignment. So I'm going to put a text box in here, drag this up, and let's see. I'm going to say Thanksgiving homework assignment, bring that up to say title, and maybe we'll drop this down and we'll change the color. So um, again, a quick and easy way to use Google Sites. This one here is for a student portfolio. I hope you've enjoyed this video and maybe it's given you guys some ideas for what to do in your students. Check us out over on TeacherCast, at TeacherCast, and of course, leave us some comments in the YouTube below and like this video. Thank you so much. This is Jeff Bradbury from TeacherCast.net.